Hi guys, thanks for joining me today. Uh, Saturday night, I couldn't pass out coming out tonight. I just couldn't. I had to come out. I'm not supposed to be out really. I've been. I've had a bit of trouble with my foot, and the doctors told me to rest it all. But I, just, I couldn't not go out on a night like this. But I think my plans have been thwarted a little bit. This field, as you can see behind me, this field, I got um, two silver hammer coins from in the top corner behind me. Uh, I was hoping to come back in here today, thinking that he ploughed it tilled it ready for planting but as you can see he's not <laughs> so I wouldn't have really come back in here because I did hit it quite hard but now I'm here I might as well carry on I might as well carry on see if I well, I don't know maybe I'll pick a bit of something else up um, so in today's video I'm just gonna be I'm gonna go back up to the top corner up there see if I've missed anything there's an old I've looked on maps and there's an old road there the M6 is just a field the other side of that hedge and the old road used to run along the back end of there and come across this other field behind me and then the M6 kind of cut it in half so I'm going to concentrate the top end maybe that's why I got the hammers from up there last time who knows so I'm going to concentrate the top end see what I can find hope there's something a bit better than iron thanks for watching see you in the next hole Hi guys, thanks for joining us today. Seven hey guys, oh, that's been hard work just getting to this point on here. I'll show you for why in a minute. I'll just show you the settings. Usual, well, I'd say it's usual, I've gone for something different. Because I've been in this field before. I don't think there's much point coming in with exactly the same settings as I keep coming in as. Might as well change it. See if I can't pick up on some of those smaller leaps and blips. So, we've got relic mode. Almost full strength. I'm one bar off full strength. I'm going to pick, I want to pick up on every little blip. So, I'm one bar off maximum strength. Get your away. So, that's what I'm going to try and do. There's a picture for you guys who like uh, pictures of metal detectors. <laughs> anyway, I'll show you this first find. Well, it's not the first find, it's probably about the fifth. You see that bleepy signal? Now, normally when I'm in uh, jewelry mode, that gives off a bing, 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 bing. Look here in relics, it gives off like a blah, 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 blah. Which is good because a lot of different tones so that I can. I mean, because this piece of tinfoil could have quite easily been a hammered. Because the hammer I found was about two yards over there. And there was another one just in the hedge line over there. So it, it could have been hammered. It's not. It's an hammered piece of tinfoil. <laughs> so I'm going to carry, carry on looking. If nothing comes up, nothing comes up. It, it, you know, it's worth just getting out, to be honest. It's too nice to be sat in. So, if anything uh, comes up again, I shall uh, stick out in the video. Thanks for watching. Join me on the next hole. Hi, guys. Oh, my breath. This is the best signal I've had in about the last half an hour. Just, uh... So I thought, if I reveal it together, will it, will it give me a bit of luck? If I reveal it in front of your eyes. It's not in that bit. I wouldn't even say that's a coin ball, would you? Do you reckon, guys? Good old crap. Anybody see it fall out? Oh, there it is. I don't know what I'm feeling. I don't feel like a coin. I don't feel like anything, to be honest. Where's it gone? Lost it. That's the problem with doing live reveals. They fall out of It must be bloody small. Can't be hammered. Unless it's a bloody small hammered. What the heck is that? The tiniest piece of smeg. A little bit of lead, I think. A little bit of lead. 
They're letting you signal. Like I say, that's what I'm picking up. So I'm clicking out every, because that could have been hammered. I'm clicking out every, every tiny little target. There you go. So you couldn't have been a coin, but never mind. Thanks for watching. Join me on the next hole. Guys, I just found something really, really interesting. Now, this has definitely been missed by me before. This could be one of those put it to the house objects. What is that? Looks like it's layered. First, I thought it was an old pocket knife. Give off a belt in massive double tone signal. It's not a pocket knife. It certainly still looks like it's been layered. You see it? nothing really on the reverse, there's like one sort of lug there, but then you can definitely see a pattern on the front, there, strap end maybe, some Roman perhaps, it's definitely got a shape, now whether it, it was bigger than this, it's just rotted away, seems to be like an iron core, but like a, I don't know, like a pewter, maybe copper outer. Well, it's definitely going to be one for the, um, what is it? I think we've got the first idea what that might be. Like a comment in the bottom, please. It'd be interesting to know what that is. I thought first that was a thistle, like a Scottish thistle or something, but that's amazing. If that, if that was, there was a there was a battle here, year, year, like sixteen hundreds, over that way. The crow flies about a mile that way, and I'm sure that was with the Scottish. They camped in in, in our sort of local park, and there was a bit of a skirmish. We sent them on the way. <laughs> Kinda. Um, it definitely doesn't look like something. Well, I don't know. I'm just a pure guess that that's looks something Scottish. <laughs> no, that's not Scottish. It's <laughs> my eyesight. I'll just give you a bit of history there for no reason. Anyway, anyway if anybody knows what that is, please let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Join me on the next relic. Hi guys, I just had a shot when this fell out of the hole. I thought, oh look at that, that's an half crown. And it isn't. <laughs> it's a top. It's a top. I thought it was back of a pocket watch at first, so I put my glasses on and realise it's just a top. But, if I've missed this last time, I could have missed other stuff because that could have so easily been another hammered coin. It's not, but it, it, what I'm saying is it probably could have been. So, I'm going to carry on doing what I'm doing. It's pulling up different stuff using these different settings. So, I shall carry on doing what I'm doing. And then, uh, hopefully, I'll turn into an hammer next time. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Jump in the next hole. Guys, nice, next find. Things are staying roundish. <laughs> the round the round anyway that's what I could say but on but on definitely missed that last time give off a squeaky now it's out it's giving off a good one but it is in the ground it's giving off a squeaky signal I thought I could see a bust on that a minute. anyway there's still some roundage thanks for watching jump in the next hole
Hi guys, uh, I'm going off now. It's starting to go uh, a little bit dark. It's still lovely and warm, but it's starting to go a little bit dark. These are the finds for tonight, or the best finds for tonight. Um, I mean, it wasn't a bad hunt overall. I mean, we hit this, once I found those two hammers, we hit this field so hard, me and Chris. Uh, and I've dug another, at least 30 targets or more. Uh, different bits, There's some bits are filmed, some bits they haven't filmed. Uh, so it shows what can be missed. You know, you think you've done somewhere and, you know, you, you miss pockets and patches and bits and sometimes that's where the finds are, sometimes that's where the finds aren't. Uh, that's the best finder tonight, that, uh, that there, I'd love to know what that is. You definitely see the pattern it's got, one, two, five, six, seven pellets on it, as I can see. Something at the top there, but I'm not sure what that is. I don't know, strap end maybe? Medieval? Looks older than that. Roman perhaps, <laughs> it, could, it could be, it could be anything. If anybody knows what that is, please don't forget to uh, drop a comment in the bottom. That was button, a square piece, it looks like a little brick from here. <laughs> um, oh, and the lid, the lid didn't give me a heart attack. So, if I get a chance, I might come in here tomorrow afternoon. Um, I might give it a quick go tomorrow afternoon. Like I say, I was hoping he ploughed it, but... Hasn't. So never mind. It's just how it goes. So uh, I don't know. I'll put this video out probably sometime next week or in the week. I fly out to Marrakesh the end of next week, so I'm jet setting again. So anyway, thanks for watching and join me on the next hunt.